Lately, YouTube has been under fire for conspiracy mongering and sharing harmful content to a bunch of children. In today's video, we're gonna look at the changes YouTube has made to their guidelines and their strike policy and what you're gonna wanna know if you're thinking about starting a YouTube channel so that way yours doesn't get shut down. Or if you already have a channel, you definitely don't want it to get shut down. So stay tuned for today's digital marketing news today update. Okay, welcome back and thank you for joining me. My name is Jordan Steen, also known as Serial Entrepreneur and at this channel we talk all about starting a YouTube channel, really starting an agency, building an online business, any type of online business you can think of, we like to talk about here at my channel. So if you're interested in any of those topics or growing your business, then click that subscribe button and the notification bell in the bottom right hand corner and we'll make sure you receive all of our updates on new content, future trainings, giveaways, everything that we do here at my channel. So guys, for the first time in almost a decade, YouTube is updating their strike system. They used to have a strike system in place, but it just wasn't doing the job to make sure that harmful content isn't posted on the platform. And if you're using YouTube to run your business or to drive more views to your website or whatever it is that you're trying to do online, you definitely don't want to get shut down. And as we all know, starting a YouTube channel is easily one of the best ways to get video content out there. So you're definitely going to want to make sure you do well, which by the way, if you want to see how to start a YouTube channel completely, like step by step, make sure to stay tuned to the end of today's video and we'll show you exactly how to do that. But guys, YouTube channels are created so that way people can release content. It's not always just a business. A lot of the time people are starting YouTube channels and they're using them just to talk about a passion or a hobby or a skill set that they have, which eventually ends up turning into a brand. And see, that's where the, the lines start to get blurred because if you're out there, you know, publishing content that's, you know, supposed to be free of speech, we're not supposed to have to worry about any of that, yet YouTube is pulling it down. It's because of the fact that you have to understand that that YouTube isn't just an adult audience. There are also tons of kids, so they have to take care of their children audience because if they do anything to affect that audience negatively, the adult audience that is using the platform will become upset and thus deter them from using the platform altogether, which means no more viewers for YouTube. And if you guys are running a personal brand, no more viewers definitely means that's going to hurt what you're trying to do, and especially me, right? So really, when it comes down to it, we understand that personal brands need YouTube. We have to follow these rules to make sure that we all have a happy environment together. Which, by the way, if you're looking at starting a YouTube channel for your marketing agency or for any other reason, you need to actually set up a brand account so that way you don't get you know any complications while posting content, you follow the rules completely, you'll wanna set up a brand account. So make sure to check out this video up here in the top right hand corner. So really guys, here's how it works. YouTube has a three strike system, okay? And really, if you don't follow the rules, eventually it will lead to your account being banned or discontinued or deleted. The first strike is a one week ban in which you won't be able to upload any new content for that week, whether it's live streams or new videos or community posts, whatever it is, you're not going to be able to upload anything in that first week. All right. And then that first strike actually expires after 90 days. Okay. So after 90 days, you can actually get another first strike again, not saying you want to test that, but that's just how it works. If you get another penalty within that 90 day period that you have with your first strike, then you're going to receive your second strike. This means that they're actually going to cause a pause or they're going to pause your account for two weeks, meaning you can't load, upload any new content for two weeks. Now, a third strike within that same 90 day period means that they're actually going to terminate your account, guys. So if you're uploading bad content and you keep getting these strikes, you need to actually pay attention to it because YouTube will remove your account. Really quick question. Have you guys ever seen or heard of a channel receiving a strike on YouTube? If you have, leave it in the comments below. If you haven't, what do you think would it would take for YouTube to give you a strike? What do you think some of that content, that negative content is that people are getting strikes for? Leave that type of content below in the comments. Now, previously, YouTube was using only email to disseminate these communications about receiving a strike, but now you're also going to receive desktop and mobile notifications when you get a strike on your channel. So there really isn't going to be much confusion anymore as to whether you're actually getting a strike or not. They're going to be pretty straightforward and tell you exactly what you received the strike for. Since you stayed tuned to the end of today's video, what we're going to do is we're going to teach you how to start a YouTube channel step-by-step -step in 2019 or beyond. If you're wanting to see that video or that training, check out 
out this link up here in the top right hand corner. But that's it for today's digital marketing news today update and I will see you guys on the next video. Until then, Serial Entrepreneur out. Bye guys. Ready to start living the six figure work wherever be your own boss lifestyle? Well at Serial Entrepreneur Academy we'll teach you how to use a laptop and internet to start your own social media and digital marketing agency. Get started with our free Facebook ads training. Links in the description below guys. See you in the course. Serial Entrepreneur out.